Good afternoon everyone, gather round, gather round. Today we're going to be talking about a legend that is so great that only real ones know of him. That legend goes by the name of Bootra. He's just making a great run, hit it! What a finish! He's insane! Nice. Back to him, that was, that was meant for Kubo. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god Bootra, that footwork is absolutely ridiculously good. Nice. Come on Bootra, get in a good position lad. He is in a great position, it's a brilliant break! Come on lad! Beautiful boys. Very nice. I need it! <laughs> I don't give a f. Wanna see some real speed, bitch? I'll show you some real speed. Holy shit. Oh, you if your panties are wet, that makes sense. Now I'm panicking. You don't panic. No, I am. Oh, that's so this is the greatest thing I've ever seen. I'm gonna come. Are you struggling to win on FIFA because your team is really bad? Shocking, dreadful, no quality. Do you need coins for a cheeky new team? I need it! You can head over to u7buy.com for cheap, fast and reliable coins. And if you use code McShell, you'll get a 5% discount. All right, boys and girls, today is going to be the cheekiest of days, okay? We have a returning legend that I just cannot wait to use, boys. I'm, I'm genuinely so excited to use him. That man is Bootra. In fact, I'm so excited, lads. I'm actually recording this on the day that my Hosolu video was recorded. I I, just, I couldn't wait. I had to do two videos in one day because I want to try it. Now, some of you guys may be not aware, okay, that Bootra is like the original channel legend, okay? We all know how much I love Veron, okay? That's no secret. I love Veron more than any man on this earth, okay? But before Veron, before I discovered Veron, there was Butra. Butra Grano in FIFA 19 was the most disgusting striker I've ever used in any FIFA. He was absolutely ridiculous. I'm the motherfucking king, bitch. I just couldn't believe how good he was, boys. And obviously in FIFA 20, we picked him up. And I did like him. I still absolutely adored him. But I didn't love him quite as much as FIFA 19. And I would probably say the same about FIFA 21. I still love Butra, but I didn't love him as much. The FIFA 19 Butra will never be topped. So it's taken me a little while to save up for this Butra, lads. But obviously I told you guys in the last episode that we did pack that Mbappe. So I naturally wanted to get, you know, I wanted to get Butra because I've been waiting to get this card for so long I didn't have the funds for it. So we finally picked him up lads, okay, I've thrown him into a very cheeky team lads that is absolutely goaded in my opinion. Obviously you guys know that I've got Prime Veron and Makalele from the last episode. Uh, we did get this Teze card that looks incredible. We got Edward, of course. We still got Ozzyman. So I'm just crossing my fingers lads and hoping that Butra is as good as he was in FIFA 19. If he is only as good as he was in 20 and 21 it's not going to be a problem. He's still going to be an absolute goat. One of my, he's still going to be one of the best strikers in the game. But it's just something about that FIFA 19 Butra boys, they're just, it was so good, like he just did things that I, I, I've never seen before. So yeah, this card does not have the skill moves boys, okay, 3 star skill moves is a bit of a shame for a lot of you guys, but this card would be way too expensive if you did. If he had 4 star skills, this card would be well over a million coins. 5 star weak foot is obviously amazing, 5 for 6 is, uh, you know, obviously good for the like meta type dribbling. The 90 pace, obviously amazing, the shooting stats are absolutely amazing as well, you got 90, 91 finishing there, 90 positioning, 80 long shots. I will say, in prior years, the long shots have been a bit of a lie, I've, I've absolutely loved long shots with this card, so especially finesse one. So I'm hoping that is the case as, again this year. I hope he's absolutely ridiculous at long shots. Dribbling here, lads, is outrageous, but I have to say it feels a lot better than it actually suggests. This card feels like he has like 99 dribbling. You full of shit. You understand that? You full of shit. Pretty the worst part of the card, boys, is the stamina here. Okay, 80 stamina is a bit of a shame. He obviously doesn't have the strength as well, but you know you don't you don't really expect that for someone that's five foot six. Finally, lads, you do have finesse shot trait, which obviously I absolutely love. So yeah, overall this is an absolutely goated card. But you know you just look at the stats and you think. Okay, it's a good card, but the, when, uh, trust me, he plays a lot better in-game. But anyway, boys, I've wasted enough time, okay? I'm way too excited for this. I just want to jump into gameplay. Fingers crossed, Butcher absolutely tears it up. I will be playing for Champs uh, qualification, so uh, hopefully I, I, I perform well. We get that done. So yeah, we're jumping to game number one. <laughs> Fuck. Come on, Teze. No, Teze, don't get beaten for pace. That's why you're in the team. That is actually really good from Kazir. I knew I normally slack like a CS off, but that save is insane. Come on, Ozzy, man. Nice. Come on, Ozzy. Lovely turn. Go on, Veron. Finesse that. It's fallen to Butra. He's absolutely taking it. That is an AIDS goal, but I, I don't care, boys. I don't care. If Butra scores, I don't care. Oh my god. No, for fuck's sake, man. Really? The way it just ricochets to him is such bullshit. Play through. Come on, Butra. Come on, lad. Gotta be, surely. Oh, come off it. Butra. Oh, 
the turn. Come on, Boutra. Boutra! Oh, that, I thought that was in, boys. I ain't gonna lie. And Makalele putting a good cross, lad. It's a great cross. Sully at the back post! Oh, of course he saves it. I'm fucking sick of goalies, man. Every episode. It's all I complain about now. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh! I want to die. I want to I wanna be dead now. Look at him. He's, he's a monster. He's a beautiful... Look, he's making his defenders run into each other. Right, I might need a bit of help here, Vron. So, I'm going to give it to you. And a back two. Beautiful. And again. Oh, that's unlucky. The dribbling on Boutra is as good as ever. No, are you kidding me? How the fuck did he hit it that well? I'm sorry, that, like, if a Ron hit that, then fine. But anyone else in the game should not score that. Ah, oh, ha, ha, yes, Boutra. Boutra! Come on, what a finish, lad. Right, get that ball. We need that ball. That's nice. Hold it up, Botsyman. Yeah, I see that run, Goretzka. What a pass that is. That is horrendous goal. This is why I hate Casillas. That's fucking Rio Ferdinand! That's lovely. That's good. One more. Boutra! Oh, he scored a hat. You're right. This Boutra is giving me FIFA 19 vibes. He doesn't make mistakes. He's putting everything in the net. He's not missing. They love me. Skretska. Yes, yeah, Skretska. How have you let Human Son do you like that, Skretska? You should be ashamed of yourself for that. And I've conceded because of it. Skoretska, you, you, you missed the sitter and then you did that. You, no, no, you know what? No, I know it's the 89th minute and I've already lost the game. But he can fuck off. Uh, no, get out. Get the fuck out of my team. I'm actually upset I lost that because we, if we defended just a little bit better and took our chances a little bit better like Boutra did, then we would have won. I mean, he got the fucking hat trick. He did everything possible and we still lost. Like, that annoys me. Yeah, lads, we might have lost that game, but Butraguenu did not disappoint. Okay, getting yourself a cheeky hat trick. He was absolutely deadly. He was absolutely sensational, lads. You know, I was really excited to do this review, and that is why, because this card is such a goat. His finishing is just otherworldly. His positioning is outrageous. He's good, insane at dribbling. He literally is the perfect striker. But anyway, boys, we're jumping to another game. Fingers crossed Butra can keep doing that. That'd be great. So, yeah, we're jumping to game number two. <laughs> Edouard's done well. Should I go for a shot? Oh my god. Oh, Ron, you are hot. Big boy Boutra. What a chance for him. Wiggling his way through. Still got it from Makalele. He's hoovered it up. Hence the nickname. What a pass to Ron. And uh, right, why is Ron seven minutes in and he's hit the bar twice then? Let's go. Great. So if I don't fucking end up scoring here, boys. Oh, goalies! He's giving it away to Makalele. Good chance here, boys. And again. And again. Brilliant. Oh, the play is sensational. And I still haven't got it in the net. This is crazy. Bro, I'm straight up not having a good time. Get it, get it. Teze, what are you doing, you fraud? Sully has saved your ass. You better thank him later. Yes, Awusu. Huge. Come on. What a chance. 2v2. If I play my cards right, I haven't. It's a terrible pass. I'm fucking livid. And over top it. What a pass. Come on. Yes, Edward. Finally. That play was so good. And I honestly have deserved... No, don't quit already, lad. Come on. It's way, it's way too early for a rage quit. Come on. Let's like 1-0. But you know what, boys? I won't complain too much because we got ourselves a clean sheet to answer. <laughs> Yeah, boys, I actually didn't get too many chances with Boutra in that game. In fact, most of my chances fell to the bald head. So, uh, yeah, there's not too much to analyse there. So, we're jumping to another game. Fingers crossed Boutra plays well. All that good stuff. So, yeah, we're jumping to game number three. Oh, fuck off. Give it. No! Oh, no way does he score from that angle. Are you kidding me? Are you joking me? It's gonna be a goal, you already know it. It's just depressing. What a chance. Please, Aussie Moon! Aussie Moon! Oh, there's no need for the acrobatics there! Just pop it in the net, no problem! Shut the fuck up! Nice. 
Okay, if you just make me a juicy run. I've played a fantastic pass. Is that in? Please go in. That's not going in. I'm. Why was it? Why? Wait. Nice. Play Boutra. That's not Boutra, but. No! Please, please. No! I hate this game. It just depresses me. I'm 3 0 down right now. And yeah, I probably deserve to be losing because I haven't played very well. But, like, what can I fucking do about shit like that? R9 against me. He's absolutely bending me over and making this look like a porno when I'm supposed to be making a FIFA video. This is YouTube, not Pornhub yet! He's a strange one, isn't he? What was that?! I, I know there's like five minutes left, I'm quite, I've had enough. Next game, but pretend it didn't happen! Let's go. I just, I'm, lads, I'm really bored of this shit, man. Like, I, this, this episode, I was so excited to record because I just thought, yes, I get to finally try Bootra. It's been fucking so long since I've used Bootra, and it's just been nothing but fucking sweaty misery because everybody's fucking sweating her ass off, not going outside and breathing oxygen, just playing FIFA all fucking day. Like, their heart fucking will stop if they don't win. No fucking way. What the hell, EA? Why are you doing this to me? I'm gonna fucking break something. I'm not even joking. Please, play it through the middle. Good chance. Come on, Edward. Take the chance. Oh, did I hate it. It's just it's not fair. Play for on. Come for on. I need a goal. I need a goal, and he's always he's always there when I need him most. I'm on the brink of having a mental breakdown, but for runs like Mitchell, it's okay. I'm bald. I've got you. That is goat-like behavior. Great play there, big boy Boutra. It's lovely. Back to him. Nice, Edward. Give me a run. Give me a run. Oh, that's so no. Oh. Yes, Aussie Moon! What a strike, lad. That was age as fuck how he got it, but I'll take it, boys. I don't even think I deserve to be too all right now. This guy's been better than me, if I'm honest, but oh, I don't care. I don't give a fuck. I needed it. No way. I've blocked it, EA. I've blocked it twice! This game is just... It just doesn't matter. You can do everything right, and the game still fists your bum. And I don't want to be fisted up the bum. Very nice. Play back. Lovely. Back two. Great play. Come on, Kareem. Felipe! Yes, Felipe! Super subs of dreams there. I bought Felipe Anderson and Benzema on, and they fucking got it back. Please, please, not like this. What a save. I actually love that from you, Casillas. All right, extra time, boys. Fuck. Okay, this could go any way. I don't even know which way it's going to go. Into the bald head. Oh, I can feel a goal. Please, Boutra. Boutra finesse. What a finish. That is an incredible finesse goal. Boutra, you legend. You absolute king. Oh! That, no, no. Oh, Benzema, what the fuck is that goal? Fucking hell. How'd you fluke that one? I mean, first of all, the chance is, it was age as fuck how it fell to him. Then the miss was kind of age. I feel like he should have scored it. We're getting a rage quit, which I love. Four gold dance as well. But that overhead kick, what the fuck, Benzema? I would take it. That was a weird game. I don't know what's going on anymore. Genuinely, when I was tuned down, I was so fucking depressed. And then in Veron, he just lifts the team. That is why he's absolutely just the baldest man on the planet. But yeah, four gold dance, boys. That was, that was a good performance. Great comeback. <laughs> Yeah, boys and girls, that was a very, very interesting set of performances from Boutra. I'm not really, really too sure what to make of it. Obviously, that first game where he scored that hat trick, I'm thinking, okay, this is the best striker in the game. Like, I'm literally thinking that. But then he kind of ghosted on me for a couple of games. I was playing pretty bad, and the people that I was playing against were pretty sweaty, but he didn't really turn up for a couple games. I say a couple games, it's more like one and a bit games, because that guy, like, quit at 1-0, so I can't really count that, I suppose. So it was, he more ghosted in the, I think it's the 5-0 one. He kind of ghosted on me in the 5-0. But he was kind of also ghosting in this game, all right? He wasn't playing that well. 
low in this game until he scored that amazing goal in extra time. So it was this is a really weird performance from Butra. I can already tell he's going to be the GOAT, lads. I can already feel it in my heart that he's going to be the best striker in this game. I already know it. You know, at least up there, he's going to be one of my favorite strikers. But I have to go off of the performance of the episode, lads. So I can't really give this card like a 10 out of 10 as much as I want to. This is going to be a 10 out of 10 cheeky me to player, lads. I have no I have no doubt about it. But based on his performance, I have to slap him on the cheeky meter at an 8 out of 10. It has to be an 8 because he just wasn't wasn't as good as I would have liked. But don't worry, lads. This card is going absolutely nowhere. Okay, uh, he's going to put in the absolute shifts. He's going to be he's going to be as iconic as ever. I can already tell. I can just get those FIFA 19 vibes. I can tell that this is going to be the best Butra ever. I, I've just got that feeling. But yeah, I'm going to wrap things up, boys. I hope you did enjoy. If you just smash that subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, peace.